Why do you get adult acne? So hormonal malfunction, hormones are the culprit. It can be stress related. Other signs of hormonal malfunction could be breast tenderness, premenstrual mood disturbance, menstrual cycle not being on time, abnormal hair growth on your probably parts like your chin, your face, your chest, uh, mid portion of your belly, places that you normally don't get hair. And then hair that you want to retain starts falling, which means you have excessive hair fall from your hair and you have the hairline becoming thinner. You could end up experiencing kind of, you know, texture of your hair change and all of that and skin color change, skin not looking that normal anymore and feeling tired or irritated and angry. These are the few things that can also happen along with that. And um, it's usually could be sporadic as well. So why does this happen is because of the alteration of the level of the female and the male hormones in our body. So that stimulates the sebaceous gland. That is what also kind of changes the pattern of the hair fall from female pattern to male pattern of hair growth and hair fall. You might also notice some back and chest acne as well. These hormones also reduce your basal metabolic rate and your sensitivity or to your insulin they become resistant so therefore your entire metabolism changes the way your sugar gets absorbed changes and therefore you start ending up putting on weight this also leads to changes in your skin which means you might end up getting pigmentation around the back of your neck the skin around the back of your neck and the neck might feel thick you might end up having Kind of maybe a transverse line on your nose some sort of pigment around your face and around the corner of your nose can happen as well all this is because of the resistant insulin that kind of starts becoming more in your body so these are whole load of issues that lead to hormonal acne which is usually seen at an age that you're not meant to get acne at times